cool. This is no good. I got some new albums I got. I got a bunch of new albums recently. I haven't said for uh, about two months. So. Two, uh, two X. A month and a half. One call he got. Ward, call would it. you please? I want to do this myself. This right here. Okay, this is Nazareth, two X's. Okay, anyway, this is, um, it's okay. I listened to the first song, I thought it was going to be great, because that one song, it then turned out it wasn't all that great, you know, because I thought it was going to be, like, Led Zeppelin influenced, but it's not really. So, uh, it's really, it's okay. Mm -hmm. All right, but I, I don't think I'll be buying any more Nazareth albums. Thank you. I got all these out of the used thing, because uh, they were cheap. All right. I got this uh, Jenny Jet album. It's it's okay. Again, it's it's not as good as I don't know what, but <laughs> I don't know. It's all right. This is a good album. Right there, and your Violence Romantic Chi. I paid three fifty for it in used records. It's a good record. It's got some good songs on it, and you can even go like this. One of the best investments I ever made. <laughs> no, but um. Eugene Shadborn is good, you know. And that's Berman of the Blues. I just really wanted to buy one of those albums because uh, I really liked this music. And it had two songs I'd already heard, so I said well, that would be a good idea. Uh, it looks like I paid six ninety nine for it. And that was <laughs> Okay. <laughs> anyway. This one's the Beastie Boys. Licensed to Ill. And I like rap music, you know. Especially the Beastie Boys, and uh, it's a good record, as I said. <laughs> Sent away for uh, songs from Ralph Records. This is Duck Stab, which is a pretty good record. Yeah, I like it's the it. Wizards. That's all I have to say. Can I tell you something? It's the Wizards. The other residents album I sent away for. The Third Reich and Roll, that's Dick Clark in the Nazi uniform, holding a carrot, which on the original pressings, this carrot was hand-colored in orange. This is uh, Meet the Residents, their first album. And again, I, it's a good album and everything. And, uh, it's a good album, and, uh, I like it. Okay, it's the other one I got from Ides, Mark of the Mole, and it's just an awesome album, what can we say? Right, Linda? Yeah. But anyway, um, the name of this one's on the back, so, you know, it's just the way it goes. Anyway, it's half Japanese music to strip by. So it's, it's on red vinyl. You can see that. It's pretty neat. This is uh, Sam Hain 3. November Coming Fire, which is just great. And I like Sam Hain, and uh, and I have all their albums. And this is number three. And this is Unholy Passion, and you've seen enough of that. <laughs> and this is Bucky Fellini, which I paid a lot of money for, and I could have got it at Ides for 350 of the used records. <laughs> and I'm not too happy about that. But that's a great album. Okay, so what? I don't know. And that's Eat Your Paisley. It's a great album cover, but it doesn't have that great music on it. Anyway. <laughs> but hey, it's alright. This is Total Diva. Which is really a... Kind of... Not really Total Diva, it's kind of half Diva, I guess. It's not... It doesn't sound that much like Diva, you know? It's, it's not the same. Hey, we're gonna play... You're gonna love them. Hey.